Right here. Oh, there she is. Oh, she's telling the story about. Ooh, a cat. That's cute. Right, listen up, everyone. I'm about to tell a bullshit story. You'll never believe it. What happens next, Encore? Yeah, we want to hear the rest of the story. Oh, settle down, you two. The Wooly Warrior will come out once everyone's nicely in their seats. Plus, Encore's still waiting for a friend. Ah, there he is. Hello, hello. Hey, what's up? Rover! Encore finally got to see you again. Yeah, where the hell have you been? You haven't been anywhere besides that dreamscape. Encore was wondering if you'd come, and even had Cosmos and Cloudy go scouting for you. Is there something you need me for? Encore wants you to come play with us and listen to our stories. Everyone was so busy the last time Encore's here in Jinjo, we didn't even get to play together. But Encore <laughs> won't let grin. that happen again, cause Encore's here on vacation this time. Is that really the reason why you were just missing? Were you just chilling out? Is your homework done yet? Just what? Gonna... Encore doesn't know anything about any homework. <laughs> Anyway, since we finally got some free time, <laughs> she's coping. She can't I think about her homework. I was so freaking faint India. or something. Oh, but he just lay in his chair, bragged about how he has so much grown-up stuff to worry about, and was too busy for playtime. Oh, poor grown-ups. They're always so busy. They don't even have time for stories. Aw, damn. I hate to be a grown-up. Well. Too bad for Alto. All I could do was come here by myself with my stories and Alto's wallet. <laughs> nice one. Let's make sure you spend it all. Right. Let me introduce you to everyone. But I think most of them have heard about you already. Yes, I am the rover, the savior of the world. Nice to meet you. around, everyone. Encore presents to you Rover, savior of Jinjo, hero of heroes. Can't believe I'm actually here. That's what they call me. Hmm. <laughs> Make sure to eat your vegetables and brush your teeth. Oh, really? So you're the big hero Encore huh? was talking about. She said you took out her mouth a little weird. GD like this, this, and that. So cool. Aw, oh, man. Are you here for some stories, big hero? Yeah. Stories? Yep. Encore stories are really fun. Last time we had one about a big bad wolf that can turn itself into mist. That sounds like Alto. Sounds a lot like Alto. Oh, oh. There's this other story about a golden-eyed kitty and his little birdie friend with gray feathers. Who? This one's about me and Yang Yang. Oh yeah, I have golden eyes. <laughs> uh-huh. There's plenty more of them. This time, Encore's got a whole new story to tell. It's about the adventures of the Wooly Warrior. You'll love it. Anything else besides that? Wanna be mean? No, can't be that. Woohoo, I love adventures. That's right. Adventures are the best. Hmm. So, Except if it's about Uncle finding the story? One Piece, we'll be stuck there forever. If you enjoy stories, Rover, you might even get to go inside one. What do you say, Woolies? Something like Genjutsu. Ah. A bad feeling. Go inside a story. Is Encore using some kind of metaphor? Doesn't hurt to check it out, I guess. Hmm, <laughs> I got other things to do. Sure, why not? I'm Great. freaking I'm a bum. Come. Encore has even saved a front row seat just for you. All right. Half the time, 24 hours of seven days of the week. I'm just start. out there in the forest, just hunting echoes. I make my own food at campsites, and I rob. Hopeless freaking Fraxidus and what are the vigilantes or whatever. And they take their money and their food. 
All right, lives. settle down, everyone. The story's about to start. Is it about the Grey Birdie? We didn't get to finish it last time. <laughs> nope. Today's story will be about the nope. woman Shut up. warrior. Nope, shut up. listening to my story. How she makes her wishes come true. Aw. The story begins in a land of boundless imagination known as the Woolly Kingdom. Legend says that deep within the kingdom's castle lies a magical gateway. Whoever passes through it can have any wish come true. Hmm. To reach this gateway, you must first go over a great many obstacles. Yet, countless adventurers still choose to embark on this journey, for each holds wishes to fulfill. Before setting off on their quests, Fairy Cloudy will ask them, Should you pass through this mythical gateway, you will be granted endless wealth and honor, along with a treasure trove of unforgettable memories. Unforgettable memories sounds nice. Now, answer me this. What drives you to venture on this risky journey? Um... Fame or honor? Wealth? None of that. If you'd ask me, I'd choose wealth. That way, I can buy all the star flakes I can eat. <laughs> I'd definitely choose honor. That way I'll be famous and everyone would shout my name whenever they see me. Wherever. <laughs> what about you, brave adventurer? Do you seek riches or fame? <laughs> uh, neither one would really mean much to me. But I am greedy, so I want them all. Oh, so this is the kind of choice a grown-up would make. See? Everyone's wishes are different, which also makes their journeys unique. And among these people... There's a small adventurer that goes by the name of Wooly Warrior. When asked about her desires, she replies, I do not seek wealth or honor. Bah! Fairy Cloudy, greatly puzzled by this reply, <laughs> goes on to ask, If you desire neither wealth nor honor, why do you choose to venture to the Gateway of Wishes? I have but one wish, to be reunited with my family. Aw, sweet. Fairy Cloudy nods in approval and offers her guidance to the little warrior. Very well. Then believe in my tale and close your eyes, little warrior and her companions. Is everyone falling asleep? When you open your eyes, a brand new adventure shall unfold before you. Once we've completed this story together, your wishes will all be granted. All right, when you close my eyes. My so, model can pick up that I'm closing my eyes Warrior's properly. Does the companion accept this invitation? Mm, oh, yeah, close my eyes. Mm. I feel like if I close my eyes hard enough, I'll shut off my ears. That's not how it works, but, you Where know, that's how it I? feels. Encore? Hey, hey. What's up with all this genjutsu? Well, this place is awesome. Is that Encore? I should go check it out. You must be new to this place. Are you also searching for the Gateway of Wishes? Gateway of Wishes? Looks like I'm inside Encore's story somehow. Indeed I That's am. That's great. How about we team up? I have a wish I want to make too. Since it's your first time here, everything must feel strange to you, huh? This is the Woolly Kingdom, a land filled with lots and lots of woolies. Look, even the clouds are shaped like them. You're in How luck. did that even I know happen? This place like the back of my hand. I can be your tour guide. I shouldn't say no, or feel like I might just break something. Go together. Yippee! Let's go. Adventure. Told me that as long as we walk along this path. We'll get there eventually. Once we're there, I gotta make her tell us where all the treasure is hidden. Ooh, I love treasure. I can use it to pay off my debts. <gasps> Please don't hurt me. Uh, I'm just an ordinary box. <laughs> don't let it away. Beware. This is 
where I'm Whoa. Getting... Stand on the bounce pad to prepare yourself to the air. When the story gets longer, so will the paths ahead. When? We might even come across broken bridges and stuff. When? <sighs> Since we'll only be telling the beginning of the story this time, we should get to the end pretty soon. <laughs> You're in for some surprises. Bah! Hey, the gateway was fast. Resurrection point. Monsters. Let's beat them up. pretty easily but she's really nice and will give us directions i desperately need directions she's i get lost really easily here and everything tell me to go right i go left tell me to go left i go up so you're searching for the gateway of wishes <laughs> all you need to do is follow this path and collect three relics three <laughs> relics the three secret treasures yeah kidder uprising the first relic is the sword of courage oh it is to Sword, shield, all of your challenges wings. Next, the shield of it is. This is a tricky one, but so long as you believe in yourself, you'll find it event. And finally, the wreath of oh, hope. Oh, never mind. A, a wreath of flowers that can reflect a person's thoughts, never with us, forever blossoming. Once you've gathered all hmm. three relics, the gateway of wishes will open before you. Perfect. Now that we have clues about the relics, Wooly Warrior's adventures are officially a go. All we need to do now is go through this door and we'll be back to the real world. Oh, thank you, Fairy Cloudy. Oh, you're very welcome, dear. If you have any more questions, do come back anytime. Bye bye now. Bye bye now. Oh, shiny. It's gotta be a dragon's treasure. <laughs> sure, it's taking a long time to load. Welcome back from the Woolly Kingdom. Ooh, how the heck did you do that? That was the Woolly Kingdom? How the hell? Is it like a pocket dimension? Yes, it's where all the Woolly stories begin. Cosmos and Cloudy's home. With their help, Encore can even invite friends for a visit. It really is a but pocket not dimension. Everyone, though. The Wooly Kingdom won't welcome anyone who thinks the stories are just made up. You're different. You're one of Encore's best friends and have listened to my stories. So Encore wanted to give you a surprise. The fights were a bit too realistic for me. You have to admit, the part where Wooly Warrior kicked monster butts was super cool, right? Encore really enjoys this story. In it, Wooly Warrior and her companions worked their way out of all kinds of trouble, just like we did. Mom said that as long as you believe, the stories will give you hmm. strength. So whenever I think of them, it makes my heart feel warm. Why do I get a feeling there's some traumatic episode that I'm missing? And Encore wants to share this warm feeling with you and make you happy too. Because Encore loves to play an adventure with you. It's just that everyone was so busy last time. But this time, Encore's here on vacation. Curious about what happens next in the story, Rover? I'm invested, you yeah. Are, you should join Encore's adventure team. That way, we can go and find out its ending together. Hmm, can I be team captain? Sure, you can be captain, and Encore will be the vice captain. Don't backstab me. For our first team assignment, let's go find out everyone's I'm the captain the now. The joys of the story should be shared with everyone. It's not just my story, 
Once we know what the audience thinks, we'll know how to work on the story going forward. After all, it's the applause that makes for a curtain call. Alright, let's go ask around. Let's see what everyone thinks the story should go. Okay, let's see. Look, that girl by herself over there. Uncle wonders what she thinks about the story. Come on, let's go ask her. She looks really worried. Hmm. Out of the way. Hey, I saw you all by yourself over here. What's your name? Oh, she's the loner kid. I'm Ying. Ying, got it. This is Rover. He's the captain of Team Willy. I'm the captain. Y yes. Hello. You're here to ask about my thoughts on the story, right? I actually have something to ask you. Ask away! Encore will answer anything! Oh, okay. Is it true that after gathering all three relics, you can have your wishes come true? Yeah, it's what it says in the story. I... I'd like you to see this. Sword. Is that a map? Where'd you get that? Let me see. Uh, it's a map on a piece of wood. That looks like a lighthouse. And a giant rock over here. But Encore can't really tell exactly where it is. Hmm. It seems to be in the Central Plains. <gasps> of course. You Tell just from that? Of course. Oh, I've been bumming out in the wilderness for of months now. I know where you're An area on the map is circled out with a sword shaped sign on it. Wait, could this be a treasure map? That sign must be the Sword of Courage. Uncle remembers that at some point of the story, the woolly warrior will get her hands on a treasure map. This map. Where did you find it? It's from my mom. This map is a promise we made. Mom took me to a play one time. I remember in that play, the adventurers wanted to have their wishes come true. So with the woolly fairy's help, they set off to find the legendary relics. Mm -hmm. Just like in the story you told us. After oh, watching it, wait, something's going on here. All the time, if these relics that could make wishes come true were real, and whether we could go look for them. But she was always busy with work as a ranger. Oh no. So she wasn't home much. Then, one day, Mom gave me this treasure map. She said she got it from the woolly fairy. And it's for one of the hidden relics. She told me next time she came back from work, she would go relic hunting with me. And that I wouldn't have to be afraid of anything with her around. She wanted me to think hard about what I'd wish for most once we found all the relics. More time with her, but now she's gone. I, I thought of a lot of wishes. I wanted to have all the star flakes I could eat. <laughs> <laughs> lots and lots of new toys. But but now, I only have one wish. Sorry, you can't bring back the dead. I want to see my mom again. There are so many things I want to tell her. Mm. <sighs> the grown-ups all said that mom was on a mission somewhere far, far away. But I felt like they were hiding something from me. I knew mom was never coming home. But I just wanted to see her again. And then I thought of her treasure map. I told dad about the map. And he just hugged me and didn't say anything. Well now Ankur's super invested. You have to help her out. I heard your story. I was thinking... If it's all true, then maybe, just maybe. 
berries. Then you should join our team. Encore knows that grown-ups always say that kind of thing just to be nice. Most of them are okay. Just a little stuffy sometimes. Encore's heard a lot of them before. So, Encore can tell what's real and what's not. Like this treasure map? It's 100% real, that's for sure. Y you really think so? Yep, trust me. Since your mom left you this treasure map, then there's more reason we should go look for it. Plus, Rover and I are searching for an ending to the story. This got a lot more now, interesting. The clue to the ending is right in our hands. What do you say, Captain? Let's get this journey started. Yes, I'm the captain. Let's go check it out. <laughs> Thumbs up. Team Wooly is ready to roll out. Objective, the three relics. Um, do we have clues for the other two? Nope. Hmm. I'm not really familiar with Jinjo. Have you ever been to that place, Ying? Yeah. Mom would sometimes take me on a field trip there. But she warned me not to go there alone. Because TDs might show up. Hmm. That's why she said she wanted to go with you. Together. All right, then. It's settled. Let's go. Got no time to waste. I just remember something. I see. Dang, it's one of those days, huh? Let's see, where is it? You close the circuit. You still want fashion? Huh? Hmm. A suspicious group is right in front of us. According to the treasure map, the sword should be around here somewhere. Why are there so many Tic Tacs? Are they having a party? Tick tack, tick tack, tick tock. Uh, they look really angry. But they're not much of a threat, so. You need to be afraid, Ying. We'll keep you safe. You probably don't know this, but Wooly Warrior once met a huge cat monster a hundred times stronger than her, and she was so. Uh, really? That's right. But even so, she stood her ground. Because she had all of her friends behind her, she had to fight, just like the situation we're in now. You can't let a few small TDs beat you down. Let's make this quick, Encore. Leave it to me. Don't run. Keep the dance going. Wait, where are you going? we can do. Am I right, Rover? Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. We'll take on anything they chuck at us. Quick. Let's check and see if the sword's around here. Uh, is that some kind of puzzle over there? Do we need to put something inside of it to activate it? Oh, it's a bit too high for Ying and me to reach. Well, too short. I got it. Looks like we just need to place the treasure map on top. You know what? What if they just stand on each other's shoulders and do it? <laughs> Puzzles. 
Oh. Neat. Whoa! There's another puzzle. Was it not in the story before? We're so high up. This Bounce. is even higher than any of the climbing games Mom and I used to play. Just keep looking ahead and it won't be as scary. It's easy. Here, watch. <laughs> Do I really need to climb, bounce on that thing? I can just do this. Oh, no, 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 I have not learned my lesson. God fucking damn it. So, is this the sword in a story that can slice through? It's a legendary sword from Lake Toya. It's the mountain chopping sword of courage. Looks plain. Yeah, it looks like it's made out of wood. I don't think it's gonna cut anything, really. <laughs> Why did I see that? Look, there's a letter. What does it say? Hmm. My dear little warrior, you found the first relic. Right now, you must be thinking, what a plain looking sword. How could this ordinary wooden sword possibly be the legendary sword of courage? Don't feel disappointed just yet. Think back on what you've been through so far. All the challenges you faced along the way. <laughs> the waves under your feet felt so high to you. And this is where Camellias fell off. Just above seemed ever so far away. Yet still, you continue to climb the mountains, every step of the way, until you finally reach the peak. Your courage has been heard. And this seemingly ordinary wooden sword is the proof of your courage. Hmm. Yeah, that's what it says in the letter. How did you know, Encore? Did it also appear in other woolly stories? Uh-uh. Uh-uh? What do you mean, uh-uh? Uh, anything else? Did the letter mention any clues about the next relic? <laughs> we still have two to go. Um, it, yes. It goes on to say, Oh, little warrior, your adventure doesn't end here. Hmm. To have your wishes come true, courage alone is not enough. You need not look far, as the shield that symbolizes faith is buried right beneath your very feet. In the clouds, in a or land covered in sand, treasures may lay, or there may be nothing at all. A land covered in sand. I know just the place. Well, I'm gonna drop down. Then let's go check it out. Sounds like it'll be a treasure hunt in the sand. Oh, she died. Oh my fucking god. Camellia just died. Cause that doesn't count. reached their second destination and thus they start a hunt for the legendary shield of faith on this sand covered beach they say only the bravest adventurers can find it as it puts their will to the test it's gonna be tedious but time to comb the beach yeah that's 
the spirit. Ying can go left, Unkar will go right, and you can take care of the middle. You mean most of the Does work. Anyone find Fine. Anything interesting? Show Fine, I'll do the rest of the freaking work. Look at it together. Okay. I'm gonna blow the beach. That'll help. As you search the beach to find nothing, you can't help but wonder, does the shield of faith in the story really exist? Hmm. Do you dig a bold boot? Hey, no littering. What if it's the boat? The boat is shield shaped. Oh, there it is. Nope. Keep it well. Bingo. This hmm. There's a letter attached to it. I should bring it over to all Oops. Hey Ying, we found the shield. Got it in my hands. <gasps> Way to go! I know who to call if I ever need to find something. I'll go get Ying. This should be the shield mentioned in the story. It's also made of wood. But look how well made it is! With the sword of hmm. courage in one hand and the shield of faith in the other, it's an invincible combo! The person who crafted this shield really knew their stuff. And here's another letter. Here we Time go. Time for clues about the next relic. The Wreath of Hope. Hurry! Ying! What does it say? Oh, okay. Let's see here. It says... Congratulations again to you, my little warrior. Although the bulk of your efforts were in vain, you did not give up and continued searching. Hence, this shield of faith is your well-deserved reward. If you ever feel lost in the future, why not take a moment and ponder on the meaning of your journey? The firm belief in our hearts shall guide us through darkness until we reach the light of hope. Now, I'm sure you're wondering, how can you find the wreath of hope? Hmm. Bring with you your wishes and proceed to the Garden of Promise. Garden the of garden? Promise? The Garden of Promise. Oh, I think I might know where it is. All right then, either Fantastic. way. Fantastic. Then that's our next stop. Well, it's not that far. Just up the hill. Can I feel like playing Dark Souls? Yeah. <laughs> Going against wind. Roll for me. Ooh. Hands up my friends. It's a noise. Get back here, you dang sheep. It's a goat. Sheep, goat, Baphomet. It's all the same. Definitely not that last one, though. What do you mean? It's got sh sheep head. This is it. This place uh, feels empty. There's nothing here. It uh. is now. But, but it used to be filled with irises. This is my mom's garden. She used to love flowers and would plant a lot of them when she wasn't busy. Before she left, she asked me to help look after it and said she'd come see it with me when she's back. I watered them every day, hoping they could bloom longer. But these flowers only bloom for a short time. 
they all withered in the end. Dad told me, Don't be sad, sweetie. It's the natural cycle of life. I understood that. But it always reminds me of my promise to Mom. I miss her so much. Maybe now, we can plant some I new ones? See, this shield and sword are all treasures that Mom left me. And here, I think she probably wanted to make oh, a no. with me using those flowers. Oh, Yang. Thank you, Encore and Rover. Actually, when I saw Dad looking sad while holding the map, I had the feeling that Mom might have left this treasure map to play a game with me. Maybe it is like what the grown-ups say. The gateway of wishes doesn't exist. And I may never get to see her again. I think Uncle wants to see something. And tell her how much I've grown. But Mom must have wanted to give me a surprise. To make me happy. I am happy. Because... We managed to find all the treasures she left behind together. I'll definitely find a nice place to keep this sword and shield safe. I think we should end our adventure here. Thank you, Encore and Rover. We're ending it here? But what about the gateway and all that genjutsu and stuff? Encore? Our captain hasn't announced the end of our adventure yet. And you're thinking about leaving already? Well, okay then. Let's call it a day right here. There's some stuff I need to wrap my head around too. Uh, I remember you asked me about the ending of the Wooly Warrior, right? Even though we finished finding the relics, Team Wooly's adventure goes on. Hmm. There are still plenty of stories to tell. Uh, oh, I know. How about you come to Encore's story session tomorrow afternoon? Tomorrow? You mean right here? Yeah. If you want to find out what happens to Team Wooly, come over and listen to the rest of the story. Be there or be square. What does I... that even mean? <laughs> okay, be there then. or be square? Uh, why not circle? I want to be a circle. Actually, no, triangle. Triangles are the strongest shape there is. Yep. See you tomorrow, Ying. See ya. Wait, are we just letting her go out herself? There's TDs all over the place. Do you think this is a good ending to the story? It's so so. I mean, it's nice in its own little way. The problem is that you're not satisfied with it. Eh, deserves a yeah. better ending? After all, Ying didn't receive the reef, and she didn't get to see her mother. Even though in the end, the little warrior did manage to collect all of the relics left by her, realizing her mother's intentions. <sighs> but Encore still feels like something's missing. In this mm. ending, she didn't even make it to the Gateway of Wishes. Just like in the story of the Wooly Warrior. What do you think? Will the Wooly Warrior's wish come true in the end? Not on this rate. It won't come true. Not in this state. We gotta do something. Even if her wish hmm? doesn't come true, the Wooly Warrior will still continue on her adventures. She's met so many new friends and has tons of stories to share. She'll remember the people and things she met on this journey. But actually, there is no true ending to Wooly Warrior's story. Remember the play Ying told us about when she showed us the treasure map? Mm-hmm. Ying said she'd already forgotten what most of the play was about. All she could remember was that the hero had been searching for a legendary treasure to make their wishes come true. Ha! I knew straight away that the treasure map wasn't for the Wooly Warrior's sword. It's not? But then what is it, it for even? Gift. Left to her by Ying's mother. 
Want to guess how I found out? I mean, because you were surprised? Yeah, that play was about the Wooly Warrior story. And I remember each and every part of it. Because that play... Uh-huh. ...was a gift from my mom. Now time for a story from Encore. Encore's backstory, let's go. In this story, there are no exciting adventures, no terrifying monsters. It didn't happen once upon a time, and it's not somewhere far, far away. Rather, it's in a little room. Every night, there's a little girl. She plays games with her mother. Oh? Playing as the Wooly Warrior. Together, she and her mom create story after story about courage and hope. It also happens in a theater. Every day, the little girl sits below the stage. The curtain rises and the music plays. She watches her mother set everything up. Bring in the woolly kingdom from the story into real life. I think her mother was a theater person? And the woolly warrior sets off on her adventure. She first climbs the tallest mountain. Looking for the legendary sword that can split mountains and seas. But it's really so the girl can prove how brave she is. The toolbox was actually on the tallest shelf. The woolly <laughs> she also searches every beach. Looking high and low for the shield of faith that could brave any storm. Her house had many nooks and crannies after all. The raspberry candy her mom hid could be anywhere. Her mom recorded all the Wooly Warriors' adventures, so the Wooly Kingdom grew bigger and bigger, and the stories grew longer and longer. They even performed the play in many cities. But the little girl's mom got sicker. Here we go. At the last show, just before the Wooly Warrior got the wreath of hope, the show ended. But there was no encore. I bet your name isn't even encore. Okay. So? How did you get to the Black Shores? What happened? Mom told me that once the applause starts at the final show of our tour, she'd take me onto the stage to make a wish. But she collapsed before the play ended. I was so scared. I tried to come up with ways to make her feel better. I even kept a daily to-do list. At the time, I thought that if I stayed a good girl like the characters in the stories, Mom would get better and better. But her illness got worse. She didn't get better. And the Gateway of Wishes never appeared. Encore didn't know what to do anymore. Mom just asked me to sit by her bed and tell her stories. So I told her about Warrior Cosmos. Very cloudy, and many other things. <laughs> she always smiled each time. It was right around that time when Cosmos and Cloudy appeared from the stories. Mom told me they're a part of life, and these stories will always be with me. Record. After she left, Encore had to become the Wooly Warrior going on adventures on her own. Whether it was in the orphanage or with the Black Shores, 
uncle would write down everything she experienced. With these stories, Mom will know what kind of adventures Encore had, and all the friends Encore made. <laughs> Later on, Encore wanted to continue writing the Wooly Warrior story. Sounds really nice. But this time, it's Record a bit you can. before. All your memories and your experiences she has her own into a friends, story. Friends that she That's can something I want to do, together honestly. To find a gateway of wishes. <laughs> because finding that gateway is the only way she can tell all her stories to her mom. So she knows how well she did. That's why. That's why when you met Ying, you went to go to an adventure. Yeah. She said she had a lot to say to her mother. Oh, just like me. There's so much Encore. I thought for a second that maybe Ying so wasn't real and just that Encore wants a to metaphysical Our time with Ying mirror of yourself. Reminded me of all of that. Even though Wooly Warrior's story has no true ending. Will Ying's be any different? Will she be able to make her wish come true? In the end, Ying said the adventure is over and it's just a story. She said she was happy and satisfied with that. But Encore saw that look on her face. She looked really, really sad. It's not good enough. Encore knows how it feels. Just like how it used to be. No matter what Encore did, Mom wouldn't get any better. My stories were the only things that could make her feel happy. It was Mom who made me understand the power of stories. That's why after I went on this journey alone, Cosmos and Cloudy came out of the land of imagination. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> It and it's why Encore told Ying that our adventure should not end like this. This story deserves a better ending. So, what kind of ending are you envisioning? Hmm. Not just for Ying, but yours as well. You're still looking for that ending. Alright, let's go write a happy ending all together. <laughs> Agreed. The story must have an ending. But what should we do? Hmm. Oh, there is no way we can bring Ying's mother back. <laughs> I mean, now with that attitude, you've heard of alchemy? In real life. Hmm. Let's go find it in the story. In the story? I remember Cloudy said that if you ever find yourself in a pickle in real life, you can always go back to the Wooly Kingdom to search for clues. You also mentioned that's where the Gateway of Wishes is hidden, right? And you've always wanted to finish writing the story of the Wooly Warrior. This means the final stage of the story should be set inside the Wooly Kingdom. <gasps> Encore sees what you mean! Encore could invite you and Ying into the Wooly Kingdom and go on a real adventure with me, the Wooly Warrior. But uh, the kingdom isn't some place you can go willy nilly. Well, yeah, but you got me, the captain, of course. I'm the captain. That's for sure. We're a team together. We should make a wreath for her and let her know that our adventure is not over yet. Hmm. Uncle remembers it went something like this. The wreath is a crown of flowers that can reflect a person's thoughts. Never withers, forever blossoming. Uh, how are we gonna make it? I mean, it's forever blossoming, so it's fake flowers? You mean, Verena? I was thinking of that too. <gasps> That's right! Verena loves flowers. She's a flower's best friend. Let's see you can also ask Camellia, but idea. that'd be really awkward. 
Camellia, can you make us a wreath? A wreath of death? Yes. That sounds nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Rina just hangs out over here in the Shade Ridge, huh? It's also where I saw Camellia. Oh, Camellia's back. There she is. Just hanging about. I want to do her companion story. Does she even have one? Hi, Rover. Oh, Encore's here too. How's it been? Hello. Are you here to see the new blossoms? You'll have to wait a while. They're still a bit shy. Hey, Verena! Uh, not exactly. We're here to ask you how we can make the Wreath of Hope. The Wreath of Hope? What are you blabbering about? It's a long story. A rundown version of the story. I see. You want to help finish the story Ying's mother left her and make her wish come true. But I don't know how to make such a wreath either. According to the story, this wreath is made of various kinds of flowers. It can reflect a person's thoughts, and it must blossom forever and never wither. Mm -hmm. The flowers that can reflect people's thoughts... Um, the ones that I can think of are water lamps. These flowers emit a faint glow at night, and passersby use them to guide their way. Or wintry bells. Wintry, Ooh, wintry bells. bells blooming cold and snowy weather. Seeing them in a cold winter will definitely make you happy. It can also be duvetches. Due to their sweetness, they remind people of sugary candies. However, these flowers all bloom in different seasons. So it'll be hard to put them together, let alone have them blossom forever and never wither. Hmm. What if we use your forte? Yeah. You created a Blake Bloom for Rover that one time. That's a bit different. Flowers made with Forte are just artificial creations. They can easily break up without actual substance. It's not the same as life. Every life has its own journey, from blooming to withering, recording the feelings of every moment along the way. Feelings? Oh, I know! Since we can't really make a wreath of flowers exactly like the one in the story, we can make one using our feelings. Okay, now you lost me. What do you mean your, our feelings? Yeah, exactly. When me and mom made wreaths, she'd always ask me to pick my favorite flowers. If I was feeling happy, I would choose a bright red flower since it made my heart feel warm. And if I was feeling unhappy, I would take a blue one. At this point, it really doesn't matter what kind of flower it is. All that matters is everyone's feelings. Would it still weather away? Well, whatever. Follow your lead. We should make a wreath and tell Ying our wishes to make our dreams come true. I see what you mean. A wreath made with feelings. With that, you can express yourself. That's right! Let's find flowers that can express our feelings. I want a Blake Bloom. Dark like my soul. She'll definitely realize that the story of our team is still going. This way, we can all visit the Woolly Kingdom together. And maybe our wishes can come true. That or Do a sunflower. You I help? Once you've collected enough flowers, bring them to me. I'll help you weave them into a wreath. Great! Oh, thank you, Verena. Off we go! <laughs> Wait. Check this one out, Cosmos. It's all golden and shiny. <laughs> Just like my eyes. You want to pick this one, Cloudy? 
Oh, true. This one does kind of light. Light up the mood. Let's see. Have you found the flowers you want? Give her a blue flower. Nah, pink. Look how pink it is. You must have been in a really good mood when you picked this one. And these? <laughs> these are Encore picks. <laughs> That's quite the selection, Encore. What do they all represent? Uh, have a look at this one. It's gold and shiny, and it matches the color of your eyes, Rover. Why are my I'll eyes so flowers nice? That resemble everyone. If we put them together, they can represent our whole team. Oh, that's pretty special. I'm sure it'll look really nice once they're all together. Uh-huh. Oh, uh, one more thing, Verena. Can you leave a spot here on the reef? Leave a spot? It's for Ying. Mm-hmm. We don't know what kind of flower represents Ying's feelings. So we should leave a spot and let her decide which feeling to put on there. Got it. I'll take it from here. Oh, thank you so much, Verena. Rover, when the reef is done, we can go tell Ying the rest of the story. Don't forget, tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow afternoon. Wait, where again? I'm lost. Hey, Camellia. Make a wreath for me. With all the big blooms you can muster. Tomorrow afternoon. Into the next afternoon, between thirteen and seventeen hundred. Oh, I see. Oh, that's right, it's one of the, the things here. <laughs> the lovely smell of all my prey. Small fry, don't bother with them. So many bandits up this road. Ooh, what's that? Ow, son of a... <laughs> Look at this place. Neat. Can't believe you did all this. How long did it take? And did I even help? I don't think so. Did you seriously did this all yourself, didn't you? Oh, I hope I'm not late. You could have asked for help, you know. Of course not. You're right on time. Encore has just set everything up. See this little stage? Cosmos and Cloudy helped me set it up. <laughs> Pretty impressive, don't you think? Are you getting ready for an audition? Can I audition for the main lead? Audition? Oh, that actually sounds like a good idea. Then you can be part of Encore's cheerleading squad. Oh, so you yeah. get to be captain now. I know Fine. This is just a small stage it was only a matter going. of time. I wanted to try the way Mom used to do it. She and I started the Wooly Warriors story after all. Besides, it'll be more fun this way. Uh, Encore wonders if Ying will show up today. We didn't really pinky promise. She's gonna flake out? Um, I think she'll be here. If not... Mm. Encore? Rover? Sorry for the wait. Glad to see you. Also, those bandits didn't do anything, right? I had to Thank get up here. Alright! Now that Team Wooly's fully assembled, is everyone ready for the story? Ready! 
Um, at this stage... This is the small stage Encore made for the play, where the warrior's adventure continues. <clears throat> Does anyone remember where we last left off? We were in the garden. Oh, the woolly warrior was trying to find the three relics, but I'm not sure if she will find them or not. That's right! The woolly warrior sets out to find the three relics. This time, she's not alone. She tries to climb to the top of the highest mountain with her trusty companions. With the mountain being so high up, the waves raging below them, she nearly falls several times. But her friends manage to keep her steady. In the end, she obtains the legendary Sword of Courage. Later, she arrives at the beach, filled with sand as far as the eye can see. She searches and searches, and all she can find are just some tiny shells. But, with the help from her friends, the Shield of Faith is uncovered. Only the wreath remains. W will she find it? Unfortunately, no. After reaching the mythical sea of flowers, all the flowers have withered. No matter where she searches, the Reef of Hope is nowhere to be found. Just through Just Pandora's like box. That. Hope never escaped. Yet, her companions want to finish this adventure for her. They gather flowers and weave their feelings into the shape of a crown. The pink flowers are meant to make her feel happy. The blue flowers uh, are no... hopes that she will not be scared of any obstacles. The book could use anyway. This wreath. The illusion of rejoice. All the feelings and emotions of the companions during their adventure. Their gift to her. And that is the moral of this story. But the wreath isn't complete. Her but your own favorite flower. So the wreath isn't fully completed. It's missing a very important flower. Yin, this wreath is missing the flower that represents your feelings and wishes. My feelings? I know. It's missing an iris. I've always wanted Mom to see a garden full of blooming irises. But those irises have already withered. What if we could find one? Find one? What if we can find an iris and the gateway of wishes? Will you want to continue on this adventure, Yin? I, uh, 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 of course. But I thought there was no such thing as the gateway of wishes. It only exists in the story. We can find one. It's about Genjutsu. In the story? For some reason, Encore has it. That's right. Because stories aren't just stories. When you believe in them, they'll really exist. Just like how it is now. With everyone's feelings combined into the wreath, it slowly turns into a door. A door that leads to the deepest parts of the woolly kingdom. Inside, the irises continue to bloom. So, do you believe in it and choose to continue this adventure? I... I believe. Great! Off we go! Permissions required. Now we can go into the freaking portal. <laughs> but it's dangerous in here. For some reason. Oh, uh, Cora, why are there a bunch of Dacid and Discords here? Would you look at this guy? So this is the Woolly Kingdom. This is the Woolly Kingdom. Oh, Welcome. I love the repetition. This is the Woolly Kingdom. This story is gonna be longer than the last one. It looks like there'll be more puzzles to solve and more. And the door to make wishes should be in the deepest part. What are your orders, Captain? I'm the Captain. Look at the Gateway of Wishes. Yes. I want to find the Gateway of Wishes and then see my mom again. Let's get going. <laughs> How do we get across? 
us. No worries. We can use that platform down there to fly across. Do 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 do. But how do you get up there now? What's this? There's a puzzle. Use dungeon attacks, mechanisms, match the pattern with the design wall. Find us. Encore knows what to do. Encore played these with Mom before. All we need to do is match the patterns on the wall and it'll. Uh, it's open. Great job, Ro. <gasps> An airstream. We can use it to fly up. <sighs> Looks like we've reached the end. That was fun. I'll have to tell Mama. Hmm. But it's another one of those puzzles. I know. Let's look around for clues. Clues in the wall. Wow! You solved it in one go. There are so many monsters. They're not stopping in. Just go, pups. Nothing to worry about. We eat them for breakfast. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Mom gave me this sword that can cut through anything. Oh my god. So now you have they just interesting. You do not just freeze me. <laughs> Guess I have to use memory. Markings in the other room must be clues. Oh. Shall we go take a look? Mm -hmm. <laughs> a little well, treat. wait. Two black sheep. Okay. <laughs> Sounds like an airstream appeared. Let's Where? head back and check it out. Are we flying again? Hmm. Down there. Wind against my vines. Suspicious. to the gateway of wishes? What about the area back there? Huh? Oh, it's you again. Oh, hey. Oh. What happened here? Don't worry. Stuff like this happens all the time. This means the story of the Wooly Kingdom is changing. But that's not enough to beat the warriors. Jump. Wind against my vines. What are you yearning for? <laughs> well, please don't disappoint me. Monsters? You have more of them? I'm not scared. I have mom's sword and shield with me. Ha! Reborn from ancient roots! And try. Who just a little treat? Hmm. Well, please don't disappoint. Feeling stuck? Why don't we search around for clues? Hmm. Maybe the sky? Two should we at the top? Oh, there it is. I right, just won.
Hey, we made it. What's all this? Oh, we're almost there. After passing every trial set before him, the flower of hope is finally within the warrior's reach behind this door. Maybe this door leads to the gateway of wishes where countless warriors once hoped to pass through to have their wishes come true. And now, the warriors will find out what kind of monsters or treasures are hidden behind the door. <sighs> is so this is going to be like the Borderlands ending, right? Which is the monster, right? Ready. I'll be able to see my mom. Right. We're here now. Let's go, just go straight in. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Oh, it's this again. Neat. Out of nowhere, a group of gold puffs appear. But they are no match against the mighty warriors. With the sword of courage in their hands. There's no fear. I've been bubbled. As they slice through these monsters with the monsters Ugh. strike. But our shield stands strong. Now, our warriors. No victory is ours. Redacting, suffer. Yeah, to here. Uh huh. Sachik is really good, but I'm just too strong. Beyond the to the white light. Iris is a mom's favorite. I want her to see it too. We should make our wish. Mm -hmm. oh, yes. This is the part where the afterlife gets to see us. Contact with the afterlife? Oh, there's so, so much, much I wanted, wanted to tell, to tell you. you. So many new stories you need to hear. Oh. Oh. What about you two? Do I get a wish? It's a very happy story. <gasps> Cut to black. <laughs> there has to be more, right? This is like the Garden of Avalon. Whoa. I can see Encore. It's kind of like tripping out a little bit. See it, right? Like an after effect. Here we are, in this garden of flowers beyond life and death. This is literally purgatory right here. The garden of life and death. And just like that, the little warrior's wish has come true. But the warrior finally gets to meet her mother, telling her all the stories and words she has always wanted to tell. But the warrior's journey won't end here, 
as the path ahead is a long one. <laughs> Thumbs up. I'm no longer the captain. Story's over. Encore, Rover. Thank you both so much. I finally got to see her. And we talked so much. I told her how much I've missed her. How I found the treasure she left behind. And how I met both of you. I never thought I'd see her again. So, I want you to have this. The legendary wreath of hope? Please let this be a cosmetic skin. The wreath of hope? Yes. Ah, oh, come on, this has to be a cosmetic skin that could be available in the future. Encore so with the wreath of hope. Wreath to keep you company. I wanna go back and tell my dad this story now. It's a simple cosmetic skin on the head. To me. So come on, crew games. Why we say goodbye. Goodbye. Be sure to share our story with everyone. I will. Oh, I know. It's going to probably be like an item. Because it always be like a commemorative item anyway. Time for another feedback session from the audience. <sighs> what do you think of this story? Satisfactory. The fights were still a bit too realistic for me. Where everyone was fighting as a team were super, super cool. Oh, he says super twice, then it makes sense. <sighs> Encore loves this ending. <laughs> the woolly warrior finally fulfilled her wish, and she got to tell her mother all her stories about the companion she got to meet. About well, she got enlisted to the Black Shores. Who she went on adventures with. Defeating all kinds of monsters that stood in their way. Their search for the sword and shield as a team. Hmm, I'm a cat. And how they put together the wreath of hope. <laughs> We've been to many places together. But there is so much more to go. And so many hmm. adventures and stories to write about. Well, maybe if we do the story again, we can meet him again? Is These it possible? stories are an extension of life. Oh, they are. <laughs> hey, easy now. Stories with happy endings. Yeah. Stories with happy endings. Mom said the same thing. It really was a good ending. The best of endings. Yeah. Encore had never thought of such an ending when telling the Wooly Warrior story in the past. <sighs> I really enjoyed how it ended. The story of the Wooly Warrior's search for the relics is finished. And my vacation is about to end. It's time to head back to Black Shores. Don't forget to finish your homework. I know you're lying. Oh, enough with the homework already. No biggie. Even though this story is over, Encore will make sure to like some missions or something. adventure next time we meet. Let's be on the same team together. And you can still be the captain. Want to do a pinky promise? Say nothing less. Or let's not say nothing less. Say less. I'm still the captain. You reach out your hand and lock your pinky with encores. I pinky promise that we'll write as many stories as we can together. <laughs> as a team. Write stories. Pinky promise. <laughs> this is just the beginning. Okay, this wreath. It has to be an equipable item.
a wreath woven from the feelings of Wooly Adventure Squad, it marks the beginning of a new leg of the journey. A wreath infused with the myriad feelings of emotions of you and your friends have been experienced along the way. The sight of this wreath gives you the strength to forge ahead. You and the girl who suggested making this wreath have made a pact. Stories are an extension of life. Stories are an extension of life. You'll never run out of them. If you're adventurous enough, there will always be more adventures to be had and more stories to be told. As long as I can get to put it